The C3, it uh, took us a while, but it's worth the wait. It's based on the C-Race and Freak platforms. It fits in the range right in between them in terms of surface area. What we wanted was to have a high-performance wingsuit that was easy to fly up. Of course, that's what everybody wants. Obviously, everybody wants it to be high-performance and easy. But realistically, what we really wanted out of the C3 was ease of use with as much performance as possible. So we didn't go all out. The C-Race is our all-out performance suit. What the Kalugo 3 really is, is a baby C-Race. If you've thought about getting a C-Race, but you feel like you might not be ready for it, but you want a suit that is great for racing, but also good in the everyday skydiving environment, the C3 is what you want. It's for people that want to get into racing, people that feel like they want a little bit more speed, they want a sports car wingsuit. That's what the C3 is. By reducing the surface area just a small amount, by tuning the internal pressure, and by refining the leading edge construction, the C3 is a much more forgiving design. We had some difficulty over the past three years of development with this wingsuit, figuring out where exactly it would fit in the range because the Freak really pushed it into kind of a narrow spot. The Freak 2 has quickly gained a reputation as being a fast wingsuit. It's designed for freestyle flying. The C3 is much faster. If you put the two together, the difference is instantly apparent. And the C3, it's not difficult to fly. It's not physical. It's not strenuous. It doesn't want to overpower you. It feels slick. It feels fast. It feels really agile and precise. Like it does exactly what you want it to do without being too aggressive. The point of the C3 is a racing suit for everybody, but also it is a fantastic suit for base jumping. What we felt so far is it is extremely precise. It feels compact and easy to handle, but has a lot of speed and flare power. I think the reason why I like the Kaluga 3 is uh, the startup performance for a suit its size. It accelerates and maintains forward speed uh, quite impressively. In the base jumping environment, this is, uh, this is really key. The Kaluga 3 will just carry more speed, more energy down the line. The Kaluga 3 is as easy to fly as a Freak 2 but it has 85 to 90% of the performance of a C-Race. 